Kelly here. Today I have, it's the Scaremeister, G.G. Grant, Daughter of the Genie. So, let's get her open. I'm going to angle this down. So, we'll do a quick look. Let's get this up. And I'll do it as, as slow as I can. But you guys can pause it as you go. So this is another uh, doll that my friend Emily bought me for Christmas. So again, thank you very much, Emily. So here's Gigi's face. Let me back her up a little bit. The camera's going to focus on me, not on her. Let me bring this down so you can see her, her better. So there's her face. And her hair is two-toned like always. She's got the pink ponytail up top and long in the back. She has these really pretty earrings on. And her shirt is this gold. Has this gold, like, I think it's a dragon. Oh, it's a scorpion. I'm sorry, scorpion. And if you know anything about astrology, if you look at her uh, decolletage, decolletage, or decolletage, whatever you want to call it, she has uh, little um, astrological symbols. Okay, so she has one. Uh, she just has a scorpion. The other doll that I have of her has that. She has the skirt on. You know, the, her arms are pink and teal tulle. And then she has this really nice belt, which does come off. And she has this skirt on right here that mimics her uh, original, her first original outfit. And then these nice little, uh, <clears throat> they're probably going to, would be called jaggings. They're slightly see-through, but I would consider them jaggings. <clears throat> and they have a really simple geometric design on them. And they do go all the way up to her leg, or all the way up to her, her hips, or, or to her waist. And then she has these killer shoes that looks like they're the head it looks like the head yeah, the head is the snake of a uh, is the head of a smith, uh, cobra and i don't know if they're bones or what they are if you can tell what they are you tell me If you can figure that out, you can go ahead and tell me. Because I don't know. I don't even know. They're cool, though. So I'll figure out her hair later. And on her skirt, I just noticed this. But on her skirt is like this keyhole right here. So she does come with her stand. Good old stand. It's just a little plastic folder. It does open if you get this doll. Uh, if you get this doll, totally. Without a doubt. Oh, there. Now it opens nicely with just my finger. It just opens, kind of looks like a little uh, trapper keeper inside. She also comes with this really cool purse. It has a scorpion on the front, as with all her things. And it just opens like that. It just opens like that has a nice Moroccan handle to it, which I love. 
And of course, it's teal and pink, much like her or her outfit. She does come with her brush, like so, like all Monster High do. Not all Monster Highs uh, do, but. And then she comes with like a, a little planner that tells you about her day and her name. I love her. I love everything about her. For her hair, her hair is crazy, but that's box fault. So, I really, really like this doll. And she'll be great to my collection. She'll be great to have and stand next to the Katarine de Mew Scaremeister doll. And I think that's the only one I have of these two are the only two I have of this line. So, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about her. What you like, if you like her, if you don't. What the things you do like about her, things you don't. If you're going to get her or not. So, that's the video, and that's all she has. Uh, let me know again what you think down below. So, I love you guys, and I will see you in my very next video. Bye! Oh, I almost forgot to tell you! Stay you, and always be beautiful. Bye!